Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Cameron and welcome to another video. Today I have another episode of Road to England. I haven't done one in a while. But yeah, I don't know. I don't know if you guys like the series or not. But anyway, enough of that. Let's get into the video. As you can see here, first game we come up against such a godsend this team is. Honestly, I was hoping we haven't even come up against many bronze seeds in this series. But yeah, anyway, as you see here, how we don't score this goal, I do not know. Honestly, we should have scored it the first attempt, but yeah, I don't know. Anyway, Dwight Gale here, yet again, he hits the post, and he hits the post again. What is going on? Honestly, at this moment, I knew it's going to be one of those games. And look, a fire here, he can't finish his bloody breakfast on a Sunday morning. And yet again here, I think that hits the post again, and what happens there, he gets it over. Honestly, I knew, I knew it was going to be one of those days, you know what I mean? One of those days when you cannot finish anything. Because look, yet again, Dwight Gale hits the post. How much luck can this guy have? Honestly, I was calling hacks at this time. But anyway, Dwight Gale here. Nice run by him. And there, honestly, I thought that was a penalty at first. But in fact, it is a free kick. So I was, I don't know, I was like thinking, oh yes, we can get this in. Then Weston here, will he get it in? Nope. This guy becomes lucky again. Because Weston cannot take cake. That cannot take free kicks for cake. Anyway, Lingard here. Oh, thankfully we do go and get a goal there. 39th minute. We should have really scored one a lot earlier. But anyway, nice goal by Lingard there. Anyway, Dwight Gale here. He's just dribbling around everyone for fun, really. You know, lovely goal by him. He is really good at dribbling, to be fair. You know, I won't take that away from him. But anyway, 2 0 half on there. Look at those stats. He hasn't even had a shot. I've had 16 shots and 10 on target. But I don't know, honestly, how does that happen? But anyway, Taylor here. I don't know what happened there. Anyway, we get out for a corner. Yep. Come on. What happens here? Honestly, I can't remember. But oh, yeah, wait. This guy rage quits for some reason. It was only 2 0. Honestly, I do not know why he went and did that. Oh, I don't know. But anyway, for the first upgrade, I went and put Vardy in. 85 pace, 70 dribbling, like 70 odd physical. You know, he's pretty good. And we do get another upgrade in which I put Carl Norton in. Now, guys. As I think, I think I said in the last episode, it is possible that we could get all like a full silver team if we do win this match by three or more goals. But anyway, this guy does have a hundred chem team here: Nasri, Boney, Jovetic, Milner. I think that was. Maybe he's trying to build a um, Man City team. I'm not quite sure. But anyway, Vardy here coming straight off his debut. What a run that was! Unfortunately, he couldn't score there. But anyway, as you see here. Kirkland going big for us. Honestly, he hasn't done that well so far. Well, I'm not really expecting much here. But honestly, what the defender is doing here, I don't know. I wanted him to clear the ball, not slide him and bloody take him out. But anyway, Chris Kirkland there trying to put him off. Doing the old, like, shaking and whatever. Will it work? Yes, Chris Kirkland goes big yet again. He's an absolute monster in this game. Starting to like him a lot. Maybe, nah, probably we won't be sad when we let him go, but still, anyway, Vardy here yet again. What a save that was. I think he had Turnbull in goal there. You know, Turnbull did pretty well for him here. But yeah, anyway, as you see here, Dwight Gale, how he doesn't score that, I don't know. It was probably harder to miss it than score. Anyway, Weston here, we all know how good his free kicks are from 40 yards out. Will he finally get his goal? No, but honestly, that was like an inch away from the, at least the post. Honestly, I don't know if he'll ever score for us. Will he ever score for us? Will we get an upgrade for him before that? But anyway, Vardy there yet again. He couldn't finish his breakfast on a Sunday morning either. Anyway, here, nice like nice um, acrobatics there from him. But Dwight Gale, he completely mucks it up. I wanted him, uh, that, that wasn't a cross as well, guys. That was a shot. Honestly, that was terrible. But anyway, Vardy here cuts inside there. Nice run from him. Will he get the goal? Nope. Will Gale, la, la, la. will Shalaba get the goal? No. It was another one of those games. Anyway, I think it was that like full time there. Yep. Anyway, getting to the second half here. Lovely ball there from Shadow. I think that was to Gale. And we finally get a goal. Finally. Honestly. We've, we've been deserving a goal in all of these matches, but we just couldn't get one here. But for some weird reason. Uh, I can't even speak English. For some weird reason, this guy, he just randomly like rage quit. So that basically, I don't know if you remember the rules, guys. But if that's a rage quit, that means that. Um, we get like another upgrade, but yeah, anyway, guys, I can see here. I thought, you know what, this guy hasn't quit, but I'm still going to count this as a rage quit because obviously he's put his controller down. So I thought, why not go and get three goals? You know, that's going to be three upgrades. You know, I didn't think that was possible. Wait, wait, it is possible, but still. Anyway, Dwight Gale there taking it round the keeper. 
Lovely by him there. Anyway, as you see here, confirmation of the 3-0 win and the free upgrades yet to come. Yes, that is confirmation also of a full silver team. Anyway, for the first upgrade, I've replaced Taylor for Bennett. It's going to be sad to see Taylor and Weston both go. But, you know, they've been the best bronze players. Anyway, for left mid for Weston, I put in Stanislas. Nice stats for both of them here. Hopefully, they can live up to be like um, Weston and Thingy Majiggy. I can't remember his name. But anyway, at the camp position there, we do put Gabby Blondahor. Yes, I've tried him out in a silver BPL team, and he's an absolute monster. 90 pace, 74 shooting, 73 dribbling, and 80 physical. He is absolutely amazing. Well, anyway, guys, if you have enjoyed this series, please do leave a like, as I said before. I do hope you have a nice day. Peace.